What's going on YouTube? It's your boy B Taylor. I want to show y'all this new method real quick. Um, I told you guys, you know, with the last video that I was going to um, update you guys, you know, because I want to show y'all this progress. And man, it, it really worked. So, you know, I just got out the shower, you know, so of course my hair is wet. Um, I washed it. Uh, let me show you what I washed it with. Dough for Man Plus Care. Um, it has um, fortifying shampoo and plus conditioner. So it's real good for your hair. Um, and it, it removes grease and revalualizes. I think that's the word. I don't know. But it's real good for you. So I recommend this. Um, it's five shampoo. Um, the steps you're going to need, what well, a few products you're going to need, is a soft brush, a medium brush, a comb. Your grease, sandwich bag, and a suit rag. Now, like I told you guys, my hair is already down. So now, my next step is well, my first step, well, second step, it don't matter. Comb. You're going to comb it out reason why you comb it out because you're trying to get that fluff and of course you will comb it exactly the way you brush your hair so and make sure all four of your corners you hit them at an angle so you can get your connections right and that's one thing that you know I'm really working on as far as my connections that's why I got the suit rag and it works it really does so, I'm going to kind of speed through this a little bit, but, you know, you're really supposed to comment. I recommend you comment, you know, for about two to three minutes. Okay. Your next step is going to be your grease. Uh, me, personally, I use Mark's Leno Lustre. Um, it has olive oil in it, and um, it's intense conditioner for hair moisturized, starved um, hair and scalp. So, I recommend this. It's real good for you. Um, it's about almost eight bucks at you know you could probably get it from any beauty supply they also have the little smaller cans um, You don't need that much. That's for sides. Slick it down real nice. Cause what you're trying to do, basically you're trying to build up a curl. You know, I recommend these this method, you know, for the woofers. Or you know if you have a two, or if, even if you're at a two, I recommend this. Okay, see how that's nice and slick? Then you're gonna get your medium brush. You're gonna brush it. And when you're using your medium brush, you're going to want to brush it for about, you know, a good 10 to 15 minutes. I mean, it could be 5 to 10 minutes. You know, it, de it depends on, you know, how good your, your um, results are as far as your 360 waves. But I'm going to make this short like I told you. Then you're going to use your, your small brush. And that's going to be about a good 5 to 10 minutes. You know, like I said, with the medium brush, depending on the quality of the 360s, going to brush, brush, brush. It's going to be the fastest 360 method you ever seen. I mean, everybody wants that. See the crown? Huh?
Okay, then once you do that, you know, for five to ten minutes, this is the trick. You comb it out again. You're not gonna comb no waves out. You're just building up a curl. And make sure you hit all your angles. You're just building up a curl. And when you're building up the curl, you that's going to develop waves. Okay, you're going to comb it from about, you know, like I said, from the beginning, two to three minutes. Make sure you're hitting all your quarters corners at an angle. I guarantee you this method will work. Then after that, you're going to get your medium brush again. Slick it down. You're going to brush it for about 10 to 15 minutes. And I guarantee you, you're going to wave up. Now this is my method I created on my own. I mean everybody has their own way, but you know it's only a certain amount of um advice you would take from somebody. You know, like I said, 10 to 15 minutes. And then the next step is gonna be the soft brush again. That's going to be about a good five to ten minutes. Then, of course, you know, after the method is over, you know, just make sure you just, you know, constantly brushing. Constantly brushing. You're not going to get progress without brushing. This is five weeks of whooping going on a six week. Um, like I told you, you know, five to ten minutes brushing with the soft brush. And then if you feel like your hair is not curling up or you're not seeing any progress, which I know you will, then we repeat the process over again. Um, like I told you from the beginning, the comb, medium brush, no, I'm sorry, let me fix that. The comb, two to three minutes medium brush 10 to 15 minutes and then your soft brush 5 to 10 minutes and if you want to you can just keep repeating the process keep repeating the process and then when you're ready to wrap your hair up you're going to use this the plastic bag method now I've seen somebody um, I've seen a few people you know, do this on um, YouTube and I highly recommend it as well uh, I highly recommend it to the people who don't use pomade because with the plastic bag method you don't need pomade because this slicks your hair down alone. This will slick your hair down dry. So just imagine what it would do if you have a product in your hair. So I highly recommend this. Um, it's a sandwich bag. This personally is a Ziploc bag but it really doesn't matter as long as it's some type of plastic bag. And you're gonna slick it down. You can do this for about you know two to three minutes. Now imagine, I washed my hair with the Dove shampoo, and then I put a grease in of uh, the Marks Lustries grease. And then I used the comb. I combed it out. And then after that, I used my medium brush. And I used the soft brush. And you repeat this process daily.
Then after you all slick down, super rag time. So, smack that on. Hair is still a little moist. Moisturize. So I'm kind of tight. Like the air out. Boom, and that's the process. I let your boy B Taylor subscribe, um, comment. Just let me know. B Taylor, holler at me.